I've probably known Lauren for about 50 years now. We first met when he was an undergraduate student at the University of Regina in economics, and he was also the youth group leader at the church that I attended in Regina, Whitmore Park United Church. I got to know him as a colleague when he was the principal at St. Andrews College and I was working at the University of Saskatchewan as well. I first came to meet Lauren Calvert when we were both elected uh, in 1986. Uh, we had our first caucus meeting and that was when we were all introduced to each other and after that we became fast friends. In terms of personal attributes, I would say that Lauren has a really strong moral compass and a passion for justice and fairness and uh, that is one of the things that makes him such a great leader. Uh, Lauren's greatest attributes are his ability to listen, uh, to look at the big picture, and to then act. Um, he's an activist. Uh, he's still an activist uh, in the Moose Jaw area, even though he and Betty live at the lake. Uh, he's very involved in his church and the community. And of course, he's trying to make sure that the community is well served uh, in the Moose Jaw and surrounding area. I've always been really impressed by Lauren's ability to connect with other people with a, a real sense of being genuine. He um, has a, a real interest in people and wants to hear their points of view. I think Lauren Calvert is deserving of this award because he has a lifetime of achievement. Uh, he held many cabinet positions uh, in the Romano government. Uh, he went on to become Premier of Saskatchewan. Um, he implemented a lot of good public policy. Uh, he was very supportive of uh, the communities that he represented. And, you know, he got a lot done in his lifetime of uh, not only work in the legislature, but work in the church. The University of Regina can be really proud of this graduate. Lauren has had such a multifaceted career in um, ministry and pastoral care, in government and politics, and in higher education. And in each one of those spheres of activity, he's shown himself able to really lead and contribute. He loves this province. He would never live anywhere else. And uh, I think in that sense, he's a consummate Saskatchewan. Congratulations, Lauren on your Lifetime Achievement Award. You have served our province so well, and it's wonderful that your alma mater, the University of Regina, is honoring you. You deserve the honor and congratulations. <laughs>